Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to Bloodborne. Since the last episode, as you can see by my blood vials, I went farming for a little bit. And that is not the only thing that happened. I warped to this central Yarnum area and I noticed that there was actually an NPC that I missed, like one of those people in the door. And I went there and talked to him and I don't know if this, um, you can get this straight away at the start because I didn't do it. But he gave me this. This is a flame sprayer. Special weapon used by certain members of the healing church, spits searing flames by using blood imbued quicksilver bullets as a special medium. Not the most efficient weapon by any stretch, but sometimes a sea of flame is just what the doctor ordered. Besides, the beasts of Yarnum can always use a good cleansing. So yeah, it's the flamethrower. I honestly, like I said, I don't know if you can get this from the beginning, but I got it. I don't want to waste any quicksilver bullets, but look at that thing. Holy shit. The design on these weapons is really awesome. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna keep that around. I deposited the normal torch, the uh, repeating pistol, and uh, that's about it. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and use these souls to fortify this weapon. Because why not? And let's see what we can use with the... Oh, you can't blood gem it. Well, I can increase the attack of my... Um, blunderbuss. Not that the attack on that thing is any good. We are gonna get going here. People in the last episode have, last few episodes actually, have left some pretty helpful comments and they actually said, well a lot of people said that I should go to the forest area that I didn't touch before going to Vicaramalia because there is actually um, like places there you can progress and apparently that is where you can get more twin bloodstone shards which definitely, definitely sounds awesome. So we're gonna have a look at that forest area. If I get stuck there or if that leads nowhere, I'm just gonna head up with the elevator that just unlocked into the Odeon Chapel or whatever. Basically where um, the wheelchair guy wants us to go from the hunter's ring. That door right there. Anyways, First of all, we're gonna get going here. I think I'm just gonna ignore all these enemies because I've made this run so many times I've become pretty proficient at it. So yeah, let's just go and not worry about anything. I'll get back to Vicar Amalia eventually. I feel like at this stage when she's like killing me in one or two hits, that's telling me that I'm probably not strong enough to take her on just yet. Luckily, there are plenty of other areas for us to explore, so that is not a problem at all. Okay, good thing these guys are slow. So I didn't really go too far into this area before, because I basically chickened out. I think I had a lot of souls at the time, and there was like the boss, and the bloodstarred beast was still alive. So, you know, I kind of just like didn't want to touch this new area. But now that I've cleared a few things up, we can definitely get going here, plus I'm a little bit more powerful, so I am feeling more confident, that's for sure. These guys with the guns are around here. Okay, good. It is like a lot better than it was before. Whoa, shit. Silver bullets. Is it this actually? Oh. That was Don't you dare shoot. Okay, so it looks like they only give us one of them to the counter. Alright. We're good. Okay, that was... A dog got into the picture here, and that's what messed me up. I'm gonna have a look around here, because... Yeah, there's a lot of treasure around. I see you there. Kill your kill all your, all your documents, so Whoa shit. Is that a One 
more shooting at me. It's on there. Where are you? Oh, there he is. There's more of them going around. Bone marrow ash. We'll check out what that is. More bullets. Alright, good. These guys become less an issue when you're up in their face. Holy shit, I'm gonna be stocked up on quick silver bullets. And that's good. Bone marrow ash. I'm gonna have to check out thick cold blood. And more thick cold blood. What is this thing? I assume it's a consumable. Additional medium that strengthens quick silver bullets. Nice. Not that I use like shooting as a fence that much. I guess the blunderbuss. I did check out a couple of videos of like what the hell? Oh, that was my phone. Wait a second. Thing is, I forgot to plug in my phone. All right, we're good. All right. Sorry about the interruption, you know, life happens. So I think that's all the enemies that's, that are down here. I think I've cleared this area out pretty well. Of course, we'll still have to go forward. There's a path. I feel like... This area, yeah, should, should be good. I only take a lot of damage if these guys get a counter hit. Whoa! Oh, no, ah, same, same thing happened with fighter gas. Alright, good. These dogs are not difficult, by the way. They, I think, have the same as the fighter gas we had before. Alright, got most of my HP back, so. I should probably go with my. Screw you. I'm not a cursed beast. I might be. I might be the asshole here, you know. This is a Souls game, so you... Never know. Alright, that is kind of ominous. Hemvik Charnel Lane. This was in the trailer, by the way. Um, this when you open the door the very very first trailer if you look back at it Hey, or what you call it lamp That's nice of them don't have to go through that bullshit again but That wasn't bullshit really. Let us cleanse these foul streets. And these are not streets though, but I get what you mean. Let's cleanse them To be honest, I should probably cleanse them using my Oh shit. Let's. Wow, those things look creepy. Let's just like. Get your attention and see what you do. I guess you're a village except. Yes. Basically. Yeah, you are. Okay, good. They are more threatening than they actually are. You probably stuck it my ass, though. Especially not all. Please tell me you drop blood vials. That would be very helpful. And you're stuck on me. All right, good. Okay. New areas are always. Uh, are always a mix of excitement. Oh, hey there. Excitement and dread because dirty blood gemstone. Oh, that's new. Oh, you can't go up there. I thought that was an actual ladder, but it's not. Yes. This is what I came in here for. Thank you very much, guys, um, for suggesting this area because. The last shot eyeball. I think you need that for the chalice dungeons. Hey there. 
At least I don't have to go back to the Hunter's Dream because these guys or girls drop um, Bloodstone, I mean Blood Vials. So honestly, that makes things a lot easier for me. Oh, hey there. Did you hear the graveyard murmurs? Yes, I just killed them. And it's almost time. Oh, I can't wait. I just can't wait. <laughs> the creepy laugh that every single NPC in Souls games have is still present here. Did you hear the graveyard? Then it's oh, is that all you, that's all you say. <laughs> Alright, that's fine by me. Sorry if I destroyed your graveyard murmur because all is effective. I don't trust you. The device not currently... Yeah, this guy jumped down and died, didn't he? Yeah, he's like healing up. And he's like... Yeah, that is... Yeah, no, that's not gonna work. Nice trick, though. Tricky bastard. But yeah, deception is fair play in Souls games when leaving messages. You know... Don't always trust. You are sniping, alright. Oh, that's why. Oh, that's not a shot anymore. I hope you get the blindfold as a weapon. no long range. Whoa, that's You almost killed. Oh, that's... That's what you're talking about with sniping. Throwing more of the cocktails. Which way can I get up there? You, that is a good ass hammer. Do you drop them too? Or do you just throw them? No, she drops them. I don't know how useful Molotov cocktails are anymore. Maybe combined with oil urns. I'll definitely keep that in mind. That I have a couple. Because those oil urns seem to do a lot of damage. Hey, haven't you seen one of you in a while? Classic enemy. Okay, he's not dead. Hey, I actually killed an enemy by shooting it. That very rarely happens. This is weird to say. Alright, you witch. They do look like witches, don't they? Oh, well, shit. Rare plunging attack. Haven't gotten many of these yet. Can you open this? Yeah, I would have thought not. There must be like something here that opens it. Oh, we have that way to go. And that way to drop down to whatever this is. More, yes. Oh, this is so awesome. I already had one in my inventory before. I did, by the way, look like... I tried to spoil as little as I can for myself, but I did look at some things on the wiki. And the thing I looked at is weapons, because I was trying to decide on an alternate weapon to use after this. And I think... Hey there, and I think I found just what I need. Apparently there's a weapon I, and I didn't look up like where to get it. Um, or where it's located. But there is a rapier that's also a gun. Essentially a, a gun blade. That really stuck out to me. That is the weapon I have. Because as much as I like this thread of pain, I want to try things. I don't want to stick to one weapon for the entire game. This seems very suspicious. Okay, that's weird. Is that like a glitch? Or is that supposed to look like that? Huh. Oh. Oh. That is so cool. I did not know you that you could do that. <clears throat> I haven't even left a message. But I somehow missed. Yeah, this area did seem suspiciously like empty. Let me guess, that leads back to... 
think I have a pretty good idea of that. I'm gonna, to to gonna lead back up to that well. Oh no, it's going down. Oh. It did lead back, just from the wrong way. Okay, I get it. I should probably send it back down in case it die. Very fused. Could have just used the switch. Would have been easier. Well, should I go into the mines or should I just? We'll go this way first. Oh, yeah, it's trying to get the Not gonna happen. Smart move. More of these bone marrow ashes. I feel like this is gonna be useless. For me, anyways. You might be like. Down building, yeah. Okay. okay, the high difference thing. It still applies. I exploded. Oh, they just threw a Molotov cocktail. That was bullshit. Uh, so as I was gonna say, the high difference with the parrying uh, still applies in this game, I guess. But at least I have a shortcut unlocked, so. It all worked out in the end. This shouldn't be like too difficult to get back to. Only a few enemies in the way. But yeah, I'm liking this area. It's nice that you get out of the city, cause honestly when I first saw like information about this game, that was like one of my main worries. That the environments are not gonna be like too varied. But they're very, they're very from what I've seen, and I'm guessing I haven't seen Half of what the game has to Not even worth spending a bullet on these um, enemies to parry. So we're heading this way. Oh, someone is coming after me. There you are. Oh, shit. Am I. S no, <laughs> I was worried about Deal a lot of damage, don't you? Oh well. Thank fuck for this shortcut. And let's. Oh. Oh, I still have to have a single attack, I guess. I thought you would be able to use the switch. Is there like no other. Huh, weird. Fuck, I honestly thought that there was a path here. Must have been like. So, is it still. I'm guessing that's <laughs> Fuck. That is supposed to look like is, it? is there a floor under there? What the hell? Oh shit, I forgot about God damn it. I'm assuming I didn't have that many souls there. Only like four or five thousand. Well, that's actually quite a bit. Oh well, you win some, you lose some. I was too busy admiring the scenery to notice. But that is really weird that that chasm there looks like that. I'm guessing that's intentional then. Alright, that was probably one of the stupidest deaths I had in this game so far. Getting pushed up a cliff. Not the most annoying, but... That's what you get for using at the scenery too much. Oh no, this I guess it worked out because I hit her. I'm trying to do the jump attack. Yeah, this one with the fire, there she is. She just goes around. Yeah, I really should use more of the cane mode. Or I mean the wet mode, not the cane mode. It is quite helpful. Right. Let's not get pushed off this time. First of all, is she gonna have my souls? Yeah. Yes, she is. She has my souls. Or not. Goddamn, where? Oh. All the way back here. Alright, let's try this again. Nice, Perry, and 
riposte. They go crazy. Oh, shining coins. I wanted blood vials, but... Can't always get what you want. It just looks very ominous. I'm gonna... Oh, these horses have seen better days. Something is gonna jump out, I know. Yep. I knew it was oh, there's one behind me. We get... These drugs don't normally bust them shard. I was gonna say, they don't normally drop shit. Dogs. Good thing I kept this hunter's torch. Can you light this on fire? You could certainly do it if... Well, yeah, you know. You can't have everything in this game. Alright. This is just like lead. Oh. I'm assuming this is gonna lead to me falling down like an idiot. But that should lead to treasure if my treasure senses are correct. This looks like... Just think of an Orlando with the rafters. So I have to... Oh, hey there. Sorry to like interrupt you. You're gonna shoot me. And I don't really appreciate that. Other blunt gemstone. Nice. And the madman's knowledge. I have to check out that blood gemstone. Let's get back. Hopefully without falling off. There we go. It's a little thingy that is not actually so far. Yeah, it, it is like a massive skull. Like a skull turtle or something. Watch should eyeballs. Once again, these are needed for the are the ritual. Okay. Oh, it's the ocean. And is that Yarnum? No, that's Yarnum, right? Behind me. That is very cool. That is very cool indeed. Is this a dead end? Oh, shit. No, it's not. Okay, if it was a dead end, I would have been extremely disappointed. Yeah. I think I can have push enemies. Like they can push me because that would be fun. Just like shoving enemies down. I'm gonna be really careful of that. Alright, we'll just wait for them to. Oh, hey there. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, well. We get more cold blood dew. I'm trying to get her attention with uh Oh, well, I guess we can work it this way. I was like, beat these two, I'll end the episode because... Okay, that would... Maybe I'm just like... Maybe one point on the next one. Alright, blood vials. Whoa! Oh, come out of nowhere, I swear. Gotta really watch it. Okay, thank you. Use that nice. The running attack, R1. So good. Alright. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode. We'll see what this is. I wanna thank Nice. I'm getting so many of these. Thank you for telling me to come here because this is exactly what I need. I wanna thank you guys very much for watching. Nice scenery. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Bloodborne. And I'll see all of you next time. Oops, wrong gesture. Wrong gesture again. Goodbye.